play a very hard game tonight, you know. Um, running man, he had a real good game. And it was that scene night, so we know that they were um, really like, pumped up to play us. And, you know, we can't come out half-stepping like we did, but we never overlooked them. We just came out half-stepping, and they, they played us all the way to the end. Like, You know, coach, the coaches and my teammates, you know, they do a great job of just telling me, you know, to keep on attacking and telling me, you know, keep me encouraged and things like that, even when, you know, my shot's not falling. So, you know, they just tell me to stick with it and, you know, it's paying dividends. How do you think y'all shot? Oh, I didn't have any thoughts. I just, you know, just went to the free throw line, did my routine, and, uh, you know, just shot the ball with confidence. Okay, Rob, you know, you're not going to be perfect. You're going to make mistakes. Just bounce back. and. And I thought he played with that bounce tonight. He, he had really good energy. Uh, he played with the Rockets that he typically uh, has when he's at his best. And, uh, you know, he played with confidence. And, and, and the biggest, biggest shots he made were those free throws at the end. The bigger adjustments at halftime were more, you know, our, our energy on the defensive end, our, uh, our pop on offense in terms of executing our plays. Uh, I, I didn't think it was good enough in the first half. Uh, I thought our guys, you know, were, were playing a little bit tentatively. Uh, I thought to start the half we did a nice job, and then we were able to build a lead, but, you know, Wilmington really fought back, and, uh, you know, they, they, they made some really big plays to cut, the, to cut that lead down, and then, you know, we were fortunate to make enough free throws at the end. It was a tough game down there at Mason, and they got that shot off on us. So, you know, we'll be ready. You know, we, we focus on Mason. We turn the page right now and get focused on them for Saturday. Uh, a great atmosphere at the Siegel Center. We're excited about honoring Brad on senior night. We only have one senior, so uh, it'll be all about Brad and, and making sure we honor him. The best way we can do that is by playing great basketball and, and, and making sure that we put our best foot forward against Mason. 